Hi YouTube. Long time no see. Um, I'm going to be speaking kind of quiet because it's late. I just got home a little while ago and I am I'm so pumped up because um, I just got back from visiting Mandy Gray. Oh, she is an amazing woman. That girl. Um, as most of you know, she was the most recent recipient of the Weight Loss Surgery Foundation of America grant for her gastric bypass surgery. She had surgery here in Portland with um, Dr. Patterson at the Oregon Weight Loss Surgery Center. I believe it's called OWLS. Um, and she's being hosted here in out in Sandy. Um, Laura Van Twee, I think is how you say her name. I'm sorry if I totally butchered that. But she's wonderful. Very, very kind woman. And I had the pleasure of being invited out to visit with these wonderful women, um, a group of them who were there to help support Mandy and to uh, gain maybe a little motivation of their own. And um, Ken Coleman from season three of The Biggest Loser was there to provide his dose of inspiration as well as some tips for weight loss. And it was just... It was a great afternoon and evening, and uh, I just feel like it was a pleasure to meet Mandy. I have watched her. I'm not sure why her story in particular really chokes me up. Um, I've watched her, I think, for quite, I mean, for quite a while from the beginning since she was posting, and she has been someone who always commented on my videos from the time that I was newly uh, post-op and everything she always had to say to me was so supportive and so sweet and just she's just a wonderful wonderful woman and it's it's no wonder that she received the grant because she's just so deserving of it and I have watched her videos and I have watched her struggle and I have watched her succeed and I have watched her jump ahead and I have watched her fall back with weight loss and it's just a story that is so near and dear to my heart um, I don't know if it's that she lives so close that we're both Oregonians or what it is, but I just, I feel, I just feel a connection with her and to be able to meet her and to share a conversation in this moment in time that is so monumentous for her. This is the start of her journey. It takes me back. I mean, she and I were chatting tonight about things that, you know, <clears throat> immediately, post-op, how you feel, little twinges of pain here and there, you lose your breath really easily, um, the first few bites of food and what they taste like, the first time you get to drink water and learning how to drink and sip and not gulp down. I mean, we were just talking and laughing about those things and how unique of an experience it is. And I think we forget that most people on this planet don't go through the things that we go through as weight loss surgery patients. It's such a unique experience. Nothing can compare to it and nothing can prepare you for what it's going to feel like afterwards. And being there chatting with Mandy and she was in quite a bit of pain tonight. She was on heavy medication and but she was still smiling and I could just see the hopefulness in her eyes and the excitement at knowing what is to come for her. It just brought back my whole journey and remembering where it came from. And how far I've come and where I'm going, it just brought it all back. She looked great. <laughs> She looks exactly like she does in her videos, and she's happy and upbeat and funny. And 
She probably will never know how much she inspires me. I have had the privilege of meeting several people from the weight loss surgery community here on YouTube and like I said, something about her story is really touching to me and really very inspiring. Um, I wish I would have had a camera with me. I wish I could have been rolling and, you know, taping our conversations. And I mean, it just ranged from medical questions to how do you hide your arm fat to... Like, I mean, one minute we were laughing and the next minute I was choking up because I just, for some reason, it was really emotional today. And um, like I said, seeing her brought back a lot of the feelings that I had newly post-op. It reminded me of the hope that you feel right after surgery. And I don't know. Lately, it seems like I've been caught up in the fact that I'm not exactly where I want to be goal-wise at my weight, and I've let it get to me. Not far. Not far at all. I'd like to lose 20 pounds, um, you know, and it's funny because I told that to Mandy and a few of the other girls there. I got to meet Melanie Hopper. Hi, Melanie. Oh, love her. Sweet, sweet girl. Um, it's funny because I I felt strange, like saying, "Yeah, well, I, I still want to lose twenty pounds. I'm still not quite where I want to be." And they look at me like, "What? You look great." And I was like, yeah, you know, thanks. Thank you. Um, it's nice to be reminded that you look good. I've forgotten. I honestly, I have been beating myself up lately because I'm not where I want to be with my weight. And I know why. There's all kinds of things I could be doing better. Is it a crime? No, that I haven't been following the rules to the T and that I haven't been working out on a regular basis. Is that a crime? No. Um, <clears throat> am I happy with the way I am right now? Most days, yes. But... There's still part of me that's like, well, I want to lose 20 pounds. And I, I sort of, on my way to meet with Mandy this afternoon, I sort of, I come to the conclusion that I'm probably going to always be the girl who feels like she wants to lose 20 pounds. Um, even when I get down lower, I probably will want to lose more. I, I'm just always going to be that girl who's not quite happy with her body. And that's something I just have to accept because I don't think that's going away. Um, yeah. Anyway, I just wanted to make a quick video because it's been a while since I made one. My little portable video camera had broken and don't leave those things in a hot car on a summer day charging the batteries because they will fry, which is what happened to mine. So the only thing I have to make videos now is this webcam, which is not the greatest, um, which is why I haven't really made one in a while. So I'm sorry, but anyway, it is what it is. So hi everybody. I'm still around. And I'm, I'm here, I'm doing my thing, and I just wanted to get on and say hi and 
Mandy Gray, you certainly gave me my dose of inspiration tonight. And for that, I wanted to thank you and tell you that I'm so super, super happy for you and excited to watch your journey. I just can't wait. Okay. So everyone have a great night and I will talk to you again soon. Make healthy choices. Bye.